doll hanging from a noose, a symbol of hate aimed at a family with children, and it did not stop there. We don't always like our neighbors, but this story takes it to the next level. A father says he had no choice but to move after a neighbor was charged with a hate crime. Tonight, he spoke to Bradley Blackburn. She's my heart. She's my everything, sir. In his 28 years on Earth. This is the first time I ever experienced it. First time. Dante Petty had never seen hate quite like this until it was aimed at his joy, his little girl. To pick a black doll, especially a baby doll, and put a noose around her neck, I knew it was symbolizing my baby girl. Summer 2017, his job transferred. He moved with his five-year-old daughter Layla from Arkansas to a grapevine apartment. But soon, a problem with his downstairs neighbor, former firefighter Glenn Haffen. He was always outside his balcony looking at us. Not long after moving in, it started. I noticed there was eggs on my car. At first eggs, it soon got worse. It was human feces on my car. Yes. He suspected Haffen, but held off contacting police until this. There was the dog hanging from the rail. And now I'm, I'm furious. Grapevine PD launched a months long investigation. Petty afraid for his daughter as repeatedly nooses were left wrapped around dolls. Police found the same doll at a nearby Walmart and found video of Glenn Haffen buying them along with rope. He pleaded guilty to a federal hate crime this week, sentenced to the maximum one year in prison. Does this sentencing give you some closure? Yes, yes, because uh, he got a year. Dante and Layla have moved. He feels safer and still looks for the best in people. But hatred and racism are real. If you don't think that, then you live under a rock. It's very much alive. But I, I prayed and I, I know that as people, we will come together one day. The world he wants for his daughter. I really do. Bradley Blackburn, Channel 8 News.